A Minneapolis nonprofit is using food to try to make some social changes in our community. It's called Appetite for Change. Co founder and executive director Michelle Horowitz joins us to explain the mission this morning. Thank you so much for being here. Thanks for having me. It's such a great concept. Tell people about the organization. Yeah, it's, um, we're in North Minneapolis. We're a social enterprise nonprofit, and our mission is to use food as a tool for building health, wealth, and social change. So we do that through cooking workshops, urban farming, policy and advocacy work, and we just opened up Breaking Bread Cafe and catering on West Broadway in uh, Fremont. So, And that's when kids come in. I mean, a lot of them just don't have the skill. You make Easy Mac at home, right? And right. that's pretty much what you learn how to do a lot of the time. And you provide them with some real life skills that they can use. And they feel really good about what they're doing. Yeah, and they're actually taking on leadership roles, going out in the community and facilitating cooking workshops with other groups, even groups outside of North Minneapolis. So it's really a great leadership opportunity. That's really these. how you get to the social change. Right. I mean, the idea of learning how to cook is not going to change the world, but learning how to have these opportunities to lead and teach and learn, that's, that's where it starts. Absolutely. And the learning how to cook and the food is just that tool, but food is kind of the common denominator that brings everybody together. And there's economic opportunity and there's um, just health opportunities and wealth opportunities all around food. Tell me where Breaking Bread Cafe is located. It's on West Broadway Avenue and Fremont, right across from Shiloh Church and next to Kindred Kitchen. Address is 1210 West Broadway. And you have a Kickstarter that has been running and you had a goal of $40,000 yeah. and already you've surpassed the goal. We is have. today the last day for the Kickstarter? Tomorrow's, Tomorrow's the last is, day. Yeah. We're celebrating slash hoping to get to our stretch goal of 55000 at this party that we're throwing in our parking lot. And it's a $5 cover. There's going to be live music. Um, DJ Sean D from Dimensions of Sound, Win Never Lose, St. Paul Slim. It's going to be a good good time. You have some great sponsors too, Brasa and yeah. the Restaurant Alma going to yep. be there. So and, and yep. you do still on the Kickstarter. You have one very large for someone really special who wants to make a real difference. We do. We have a, a dinner for ten people at Breaking Bread, cooked by Andrew Zimmerman and Gavin Kaysen of Spoon and Stable. Yeah. Um, together they will serve the meal and sit down with you and chat and swag bags for everybody with all the bizarre food goodies. And uh, five couples, it's only $1,000 each. So yeah. And I, making a real difference for young people. Absolutely. I was tempted. Yeah, Jason and I, we wouldn't mind joining the table too. If, if that, if that <laughs> yeah, if you need another. Well, we, we, need we do need people. dishwashers. So if you guys want to come. Sounds uh, good. Sounds good. <laughs> Let me give you the information about the party one more time. It's called the Youth is the Truth Party. It's Saturday, 5 until 10. Bring the kids, bring whoever you want. Five bucks a shot at Breaking Bread Cafe in Minneapolis. All of the information at WCCO.com slash links and on our Facebook page as well. Michelle, thanks so much. Good thank luck tomorrow. You. Get that money. Yeah, yeah thank you. The Youth is the Truth. <laughs> I like it.